guys today we are gonna make a woolen mat and for this activity you'll need glue any glue that works on woolen things um, some wool and a jute rope and a needle and a thread so let's start okay so now I took six strands of wool and you're gonna make a braid from them you can see the length if you see like as much it should be at least three feet long okay so i'm gonna take these six strands and i'm gonna tie them with a the rubber okay so now i tie them together and now i'm gonna take two two strands and i'm gonna start making the braid so let's start now you see i start making a braid and like this i'm gonna continue till the end okay so now you see my braid it's ready and when I'm done with the end, if you see, I just tied the end as well. We will make more braids like this, two, three to four braids. And if you want to just change the color, it's fine. Okay, so I made four different braids and you can also mix the colors if you don't have a lot of colors. So I made four of them. So for the next step, you'll also need a UHU glue. So now, now we are gonna Put the glue and we're gonna just make it roll and while we're just ro rolling it we'll also put the glue with it so this is how we're gonna continue till the braid it's totally finished okay and when it's finished you can continue this with the other braid you can see I'm and I'm gonna just roll it and with the roll I'm gonna put the glue and if you have difficult like this, you can just put the glue halfway and you could just then roll it. So it's a pretty easier way. So you see, um, you see that now I'm gonna just put the glue here. Uh, you can see it's, you know, being pretty neat. And I'm gonna just fold it, but downwards, okay? You should fold it downwards and this is how we are gonna continue okay so you see till the end okay so i'm almost done and you see this part it's pretty neat and it's if it we paste it so it would not give a neat look so we're just gonna cut this part okay okay so i cut it and the rest part you can see we're just gonna paste it so it looks neat so now I'm done with the first braid and the second braid I'm gonna connect the second braid with the first braid and we are gonna make it flat okay so we're gonna continue like this so now we are gonna just um, join it from where we left it but you see this part we're gonna put it under it so it gives a neat look and we're gonna continue we're making it flat until it's finished so now you can see i have started connecting it so we are gonna continue with it so we are gonna continue with it but we should make it a little you know flat okay not down or up flat. so you're just gonna hold it for a while and then you're gonna continue the same way okay so this is how you're gonna go on so now uh, you can see I'm done with it as we did with the last one we are gonna do the same with this one we're gonna cut the extra part you see and gonna paste the rest of it so I hope you're making neat okay because this work needs neatness so now I'm starting with the third rope or third braid and I'm gonna do the same thing which I did with this one and the second one. So now as you see I'm done with this uh, third one as well and now the last layer is left and that's the fourth one. You see? So you see this is the fourth layer and probably I'm gonna do the same thing with the fourth one. So if you want to make it more neat when you glue it, you can also just put a scale on it for making it a little hard. And so it will just go a little down if it's up. 
and it will make it much neater so you see I'm continuing it like this and it looks pretty you know wow so you see this uh, this is again left and we're gonna cut it with the scissors again so now I'll glue it properly and gonna put the extra part under the it okay if you see under it so it looks neat so it will look like this but it's still not over yet but um, from the upside it will look like this and from the downside it will look like this till now okay um, we are just now the time for the thread and needle in order to make it you know more strong we and now I'm gonna stitch it because we just glued it and glue may you know fell off so now we're gonna stitch it so now I'm stitching it you can see and I'm not stitching it from the front side rather I'm sticking it uh, stitching it from the back side and if you don't know how to stitch I'm showing you take some purple and some you know the white side and stitch them together so now you see I have done the stitching you can see and you could do this stitching for all of it till the last one and so this was our today's activity I'm gonna show you on the I'm gonna show you how does it looks on something so so now you see I am ready with it and you can put anything you want a war or perfumes if you want if you like perfumes so you can put perfumes as well and the third thing you can put is a vase as well you see full of flowers it looks like neat and looks pretty you know it's a decoration piece so i hope you liked today's video please like my channel please like this video subscribe my channel and don't forget to share it so thank you for watching